trying. I'm Megan Gacious, and this is for week eight um, discussion. Um, in this discussion, I will review a book by George M. Marston that we've been reading throughout this class. Um, George M. Marston is a expert in the history of Christianity. He's taught at Calvin College, Duke University, um, and Notre Dame. The book we've been reading this class is called The Outrageous Idea of Christian Scholarship. And the purpose of this book was um, to provide some positive guidelines for what Moth Marsden has in mind when he urges that Christian perspectives and the perspectives of other religious groups be accepted as legitimate in the mainstream academy. When we were reading this book, um, it was Marsden had, uh, there was one thing that popped out to me. Um, Marsden offers the idea that uh, there is this battle going on between science versus religion, um, and it is just deeply ingrained in the minds of professors and academics, and this is something I've, I've actually experienced when I was getting my bachelor's degree. Um, I sat through many classes saying that my worldview is completely wrong um, as a Christian, and um, as a Christian and um and my political stance was just is just completely wrong now do they know that I was um Christian or my political stance no but my professor was talking about um the Christian worldview as a whole and I sat through many classes saying that um science was the way to go and that it was wrong so I really related to this when we were reading about this chapter um, because I have experienced and that it is ingrained in so many so many professors and academics um, upon doing research about this book I found a review in the Catholic Education a journal of inquiry and practice it was volume one issue two and this actually had several different um, reviews about this book um but there's one that stood out to me by diana stanto of osu um that it has the potential and this is what she said it has the potential to stir heated discussion among interested and informed faculty and i think that's true um like i said i've experienced i've experienced what marsden has brought to the plate and it really does um now if i would have stated my beliefs um i would have um probably experienced more um and she just and she says that marsden brings up compelling arguments about this idea um now i found a response to the reviews um, by George M. Marsden. It was put on by the same journal, but it was volume one, issue three, and it was issued within the same month. Um, and in this, Marsden really agrees with m most of the reviews, um, and he takes criticism very well, and he points out that, um, you know, he agrees with the criticisms, and he points out that he you know, maybe he should have done uh, some done some of this a little bit better. Um, that he should have had more defined um, definitions of things, and that um, when he was talking about that science, the science versus religious battle, that he should have offered um, some actual evidence of this happening.